Well, it's morning time. Well, kind of sort of. It's uh, 10, 10, 20, 20 something. or something. Yeah, we're getting on a bus. We're going to go up to the Ebit Elp. We're going to get in a cable car and go to the top up there. Uh, had an interesting last few days. Um, yesterday morning, Karina told me I wouldn't eat those eggs. Ah. They just put a little cream in there, they maybe were milk. <laughs> they, they, were... they were slimy. Ugh. So. And he gives me the spiel on, oh, the three minute egg, and it's. No. Is that our better bus? No. No, okay. Anyway, so. <laughs> so I. Uh, I proceed to eat them, and then on our way here, we had to take a nice, beautiful train ride down the, to uh, Gallon. Through yeah. Zurich and St. Gallen. Yeah, yeah it's St. Gallen. Yeah. And yeah. I thought we were at altitude, and me, you know, I'm paranoid. I can't breathe up here in the altitude. And, and she's like, it's in your head. I said, maybe it's in my head. You know, I, I understand, you know. Well, come to find out, I kind of had a little touch food poisoning. <laughs> on the train ride to uh, Zurich, I guess Zurich. It doesn't matter. Whatever. On our way here to Eppenzell, um, I had to go to the bathroom and had to upchuck all of breakfast. Uh, in a train bathroom. In a train bathroom. And I did so That's good. So... I, I projectile vomited very, very nicely <laughs> till the very end, to the very last time. And then it was poor bastard after me. <laughs> I cleaned up as well as I could. But uh, um, so now we're uh, after last night, I, 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 as soon as we got to the hotel, I crashed. I told Karina, I said, get the hell out of here. Go go explore. Go see something cool. Because um, I'm no use to you right now. And then she said I was asleep in a minute and a half. Yeah. And then uh, as soon as she got back, I felt fine, felt fine. As soon as she walked in the door, I had to run to the bathroom and puke some more. So, so then it takes us to this morning. And I said, we're going to go down to the Green Cross, the pharmacy. <laughs> I go in there, and it's all it is is a bunch of drawers on the wall. Drawers, that's it. And so I have to have in, in broken English and broken German, you know, I don't know all that much. And, but we figured it out going this way and going this way. And did you have a fever? And I had a fever. Um, so the best part was listening to him talk to this, like, she was like 90 years old. Oh, well, she told this me, she goes, I can't hear. Swiss lady. And he's trying to explain about his bubble movements. Yeah. <laughs> Tell him I'm shitting like a goose. And and, she's, and she's I can't like, translate oh, it doesn't that. come out here. <laughs> It was awesome. It was awesome. Um, yeah. But she, then I, and I noticed the modium on the wall as she pulled off two boxes of stuff. And because uh, they don't have Pepto Bismol here, and uh, so she, um, she goes, "Oh no, 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 no! I got something even better." She says. So she goes over to the, the drawers and pulls out. It looks like a, a wall full of drawers. Pulls out a modium two. This is twice as good. She says. You only take one. If you need another one, you got a really bad case. So we paid her. and We're on our way. Now we're gonna go up in the mountains. So uh, <laughs> hope, hope, to, hope to goodness I ain't got to go because there ain't no trees up there. It's just a bunch of rock and tourists. So this could get interesting. Um, I won't pull out the video. So <laughs> uh, you'll see us next with some more, uh, some more scenery. All right, talk to you. Okay, we just got off the bus. Look at this. See that cable car right there? See where it's going? No, you can't see where it's going. That's where we're going. I might puke. <laughs> Whew. Yeah, this is beautiful. I don't know if I can do that. <laughs> oh. So our adventure begins. We got the mountain to ourselves because, uh, as you can tell, this beautiful view out there. Um, <laughs> pretty cloudy, but uh, here we go. Just so you know, I survived the cable car, and it wasn't yeah. as traumatizing as I thought. As long as I held on to something, yeah. I couldn't take a step though. I tried to get over to the window, and I couldn't. Uh, couldn't do it. <laughs> yeah. but and it surprisingly, I my I don't have a hard time breathing up here, so this is pretty awesome. So we're gonna, we're gonna get a little picture of the map right here. We got, then we got to walk down like it was 5.4, 5.4 kilometers, I think, is what we're walking. Yeah, total. We don't know where we're going, but. Okay, I think we've came down, I don't know, 15 minutes? <laughs> this, uh, I don't know if you can tell, 
these rocks right here in this path it's pretty slick um and it's way steeper than it looks too. it is it is it is like right now <laughs> I'll, I'll do it right here this is this is like level if you can see how steep that is I, I, maybe i'm right about there and and i ain't worried about breathing i could breathe fine but i tell you what gravity when you're <laughs> as fat as me it's a footing too it's yeah it's, it's, Kind of slick. Gravity sucks. And, and remember, Scott, I said uh, base camp. Yeah, base camp. Man, I was so full of shit. <laughs> ain't no way. I'm just walking down. I ain't even walking up. Down there. We there's, literally have the mountain to ourselves. Like, it's, yeah, there's nobody like here. It's quiet. You can hear the birds chirping. It's yeah. phenomenal. And when I fall and uh, and I start screaming <laughs> nobody's, in pain, nobody's going to see us. Nobody's going to hear me. Yeah. Uh, I can already feel it in my knees. This, this fat body's <laughs> just going to tear up my knees. I'm telling you. All right. We'll, we'll get some more. Maybe you can see some more when we uh, get down a little lower. Cap, this is for you. I'm not really dumb, but <laughs> I promise you I'll do it. Ricola! It didn't echo, though. <laughs> And this is what they're famous for here. This is this is like the traditional what the travelers eat when they're hiking, I guess. But everybody said that we have to try it, so it looks amazing. And we add some good crusty bread. Good crusty bread to go with it. So, so how is it? It's, there's no such thing as anything like this back in the States. And the cool thing is like like this is Appenzell cheese on the hash browns. If you can see, like these are thick hash browns. If you can see that, yeah, they're not paper thin ones. No, and they're crusty and yummy. But this is Appenzell cheese, and then we're drinking Appenzell beer. Like everything is local. Like, every, they don't. There's nothing that's from somewhere else. Like everything they do here, like we watched, and so nothing came from Myers. <laughs> no, but that's, yeah. So, <laughs> this is not for the fainted heart, just just on you, but it is so worth it. As you can see, as we're coming down the mountain, we shed some clothes because it's definitely getting warmer, and the legs are kind of like jello. I'm dying. But, <laughs> but I don't know how far we've been climbing for or descending, probably an hour and a half at least. I would think. I'm dying. Some of it's kind of treacherous because it's there's a lot of it through the forest, so it's like a lot of slippery rock when you get because it doesn't dry out at all. So it's. It's kind of kind of scary, but as you can see from like behind us, it's yeah. I wouldn't I wouldn't this is this day right here is worth the entire trip, yeah. hands down, regardless yeah. of I food, think we've drink, said that every, I know. It just keeps every time. No, but this is this is different. Though. We've taken a hundred pictures each. Every time we, we turn a corner, <laughs> ooh, look at this, look at this one. I know, but and did I mention? I'm dying. <laughs> Check, but this, look, out. But look Check this out. Just Check this out. Check this out. Look at this. So right behind us is right here. And it goes all the way up there. That's where we started from. Yeah. This is. Yeah, I'm... Only in Switzerland do you have a turnstile going down the mountain. We've seen three other people, four other people. They were going up and we were coming down. We haven't seen anybody coming down. Why is there a turnstile? I don't get it. It didn't click though, did it? No, but, but I can't think of any other reason why it'd be there. Uh, Unless you decide to fall down there and it catches you. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. So, <laughs> I didn't die yet. We made it to. CLC. This is like, I think, I'm pretty sure it's like three quarters of the way down. This is our kind of our stopping point. And as you think, I don't know if you can see. Can you see that behind us? 
I don't. The Alpine Lake, it's gorgeous. And uh, Kendra, this, this is a shout out to you, Dr. Gordon. Cowell Cancer Center, thank you very much. Well, you guys, I wouldn't be here, so I've been thinking about it for <laughs> half an hour. How I'm gonna say this, and I'm tearing up, and I'm tearing up. But uh, take the phone in and show Dr. Gordon with you because I know he's too old for Facebook because he's old and crabby and he don't do that crap. So uh, he should be back from Germany by now or his, his Rhine tour. But I uh, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you very much. Um, without you guys, we wouldn't be here. And uh, this is a bucket list day for sure. Big time. Regardless of anything. Oh, I don't, in the pictures. I wish you, you guys see. could. You know, <laughs> could come out of the camera and look around because it's, it's crazy. It really is. It just goes straight up, straight up. And we were at the top. I mean, we, you can't even see where we were at. That's how high we were. And uh, a little sketchy coming down, but uh, I can't imagine. And then when we started to come back up, we had to come up about maybe 100 yards upwards. And I'm like, oh, this ain't so bad. It was a pretty steep. Different, thing, but... different set of muscles weren't being stressed because going down the whole way was getting kind of hard on the calves. And it wasn't even 20 yards in and my calves were burning going up. I'm like, there's no way we could have walked up. There's no way, no way. But uh, thank you. We're gonna go get something to drink. Um, I think I want a Coke. I don't, I can't do a beer. Uh, she might. Do a, little pan do a little panoramic, just so you can see like where we're at. We were, we were using somebody's vehicle right there. Yeah. That's the, that's where we just came up from. It's the valley. That's how they get their food up here. There's a guest house down there. This is where I think where we're gonna go if it's uh, if it's open. <laughs> it doesn't do it doesn't do justice. So. Okay. Yeah. Talk to you. So we just came out of the train station. We made it, in other words, because yeah. we're back to Yeah, we're Appenzell. back to Eppenzell. We needed a, a train ticket to um, St. Gallen to catch our next train to Munich for tomorrow. And we just got so done To having, get there, we have to get take a train and a bus. Both. And a bus, yeah. And it's not, about, about an hour, 50 yeah. minutes. Yeah, um, we just bought two Cokes and, a, and, a, <laughs> and it was like a Fig Newton, a giant homemade Fig Newton from Eppenzell for 14 1430 or 1430 it's a 1430 we just got two tickets to for a train say, and a bus for a train and a bus for 19 people. bucks um so i love public transportation over it's, here it's so much better <laughs> all right we're gonna so we go live home. through it and we're gonna apologize because the video is probably gonna be really long but oh, no. in good. order to show you what we did today it's amazing you have to see it i gotta so. say something i gotta say something too every bit that you guys are seeing here was planned out by her she planned the whole thing. She did an amazing job so far. Hopefully it doesn't, you know, knock on wood. Um, yeah, we're not done yet. We're not so. done yet, but she has done an amazing yeah. job. Every she, piece of it she has planned and done herself. So uh, hats off to you. All so right. far, so good.